Hey guys, Dcat here with another YouTube video. I don't know why I'm doing a lot of these right now. I just feel like playing some Minecraft adventure maps. But we jumped from 1.10 to 1.14 now. We are playing a map that is about how this map maker created this map, so a little meta, I guess, so let's get going. I've already read all the rules. There's actually there's no rules here. It's just giving you information about the map and recommendations for recording. Uh, and it's development history, which we don't really need to get into. It's just it's talking about issues he's had with uh, setting up the map with Planet Minecraft and whatnot, and changes between the first version of this map and the second one which we are currently playing on. So, uh, let's get going. Help. If you get stuck, click this to see a, the video guide. Oh. Oh. He was right. There is a lot of writing. This room and the, the same signs are the first things that I am doing in this map. Well, after changing most of the game rules, this concludes most of the map's concepts other than the fact that is way for me to learn how the revised commands for 1.13. Right, wait. This room and these same signs are the first things that I'm doing in this map. This, other than the fact that is way for me to learn the revised commands for 1.13. Right now, I don't even know what I'm doing next while I'm typing this. I'm thinking about it. An idea I came up with a few minutes ago is that going it is that is going to be divided in parts, each with other signs explaining my thoughts behind them. I only hope not to not annoy you. Well, now I'm going to start doing something else than writing. That was hard to read. Kind of random. Hey there, this map is a test after my last creation, Adventure System. A map where I wanted to give others, give others some simple tools for making better maps. I had to take a lengthy pause from Minecraft because I had to get my degree a kinda important task that problem is, it was while commands started to change. For the better, for Minecraft 1.13. Turns out, I now need myself help to learn all the new stuff that has been added. And what better way to learn than trying to make something? This is why I started making this map and why it will probably suck. Not sorry. PM Expert. Here I will put some links about some nice words about myself right now. Though I don't feel like it, I wrote that I was... What? I don't know. Let's go, guys. Let's go. Press this button to start the map. Actually, I will put the redstone only after I'm done with this map. For now, it's simply be a useless wooden button, and these are also useless signs I wrote. Hey, the button worked! It's not completely useless. Okay, I've spent a few hours learning slash execute and the, the best thing ever. Slash teleport facing. While doing that, I also discovered they are also amazing. You probably don't understand what I'm talking about, so let's get st I have no idea. Let's get started with this map in the simplest puzzle in Minecraft. Parkour! Other than that, keep an eye out for secrets. Find them to obtain something. I still have to decide. What a nice tree. It is a nice tree. Oh. This place is cool. Optional mandatory. Let's go off. Let's go after the optional guys. I can do this. Trust me. Oh, I'm supposed to do this. I think I, I think I was doing that wrong. Oh no. Parkour is very different from when I used to do it. Come on. Come on, slime block. 
There we go. Now what? Oh. I'll probably be back when this is done. I don't know. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh my god. Do this. There we go. No! Ah! Wait, where exactly does this optional part go? Up to the tree. And where does the mandatory go? I have no idea where the mandatory goes, it just goes in a circle. There we go. I did not need to do any of that! I think. Come on, up and at him. There we go. Almost one jump left. That was two jumps! Uh, wait. Was I not supposed to come over here? Wait, where am I supposed to go? Where am I supposed to go from here? Oh. Oh. Okay, so I come around the tree and then where do I... Where are we supposed to go with this? Or are we only supposed to come over to here? Good job, this short section was supposed to be mandatory, but it felt too difficult. It might have been six months, but I'm still good at parkour. So what seems easy to me is actually difficult, and I want to make sure the map more accessible. There's no price here, but maybe I will later add an achievement to this map. We'll see. Wait. What? Is the entire tree not net needed? Do I... I don't understand what the purpose of the tree is. I... I don't know where I'm supposed to go for... Oh! There's a slime block! Oh, fuck me. Um, I missed. That was supposed to be a challenge where the players would have constantly faced endstone planets while having to jump. After many tests, the whole puzzle has been scrapped. What seemed like a cool idea turned out to be extremely frustrating and not fun at all.
Yes! Victory! I made it back. Oh. Where am I going with this? No! I made it! I made it! Right now, I'm writing it after having completed almost everything in this section. It has been long since last time I wrote, and I made many things. The first one being another failure. My idea for the puzzle was a black hole in the center would have attracted the player, making jumping more difficult. I was able to make it work almost as I wanted. But a bug and the overall jankiness made me scrape once again, scrap once again. Something I spent a lot more time working on. Oh. That's cool. I hope I don't need to restart all the way at the beginning if I fall. Because that was a pain in the ass. Oh no, not another area! After that other failure, I decided to try something simple, while still using some new 1.13 features. By the way, it was just about two days ago that it was announced that the aquatic update will be part of 1.13. This means this map will be probably completed before the release, which isn't really great. I just hope I won't need to remake a lot of the redstone. Anyway, back to the little map. This puzzle is pretty straightforward, but maybe a little bit frustrating. Don't hesitate too much. Oh no. It's like Frogger. Oh no, it's like Frogger. Oh no, I need to jump to that, that one. Then to the magma. Then to that one. Okay, I can do this. I can do this. I... 
Okay, thank god I don't need to completely restart. If I had to start Blackout's app platform, this would be the end of the map for me. Oh god. That was a troll checkpoint. All the way back at, back at the beginning. Okay, there's a low there's a low platform I can jump to right behind the sun. No! I didn't jump. Oh my god! Diorite goes right up to you! Here it comes back around. I need to jump to that thing. So, nearly a full rotation? Oh god, it's fast! Oh god, it's fast! No! So I was planning on simply writing about the new puzzle, but message where I was talk about 1.13, well for some reason it, it's the problem, the message had two quotation marks inside, and removing them fixed it. That shouldn't have been the case, well now enjoy the last puzzle in this one section. I'm really happy with the result. It's so cool, hence the blocks may become invisible, but they are always there. No. No, 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 no. No 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 This random map has bested me
43 minutes of parkour and I didn't wasn't able to do the last two no